So one of the best things that I have found for increasing volume when you feel you've hit a plateau and you can't like, you know, you can't add on that extra pull up, you can't add on that extra push up, is to instead of your normal workout one day, do something called greasing the groove, okay? You focus on just one exercise, sorry, you focus on just your pull ups or just your push ups. And what you're gonna do is you're gonna do basically a graduated ladder of repetition. So when you start out, the first set, you're gonna do one. You're gonna do one pull up. So you go up, one, and down, that's it. And then you're going to rest, take a break for a minute, and the next time you go up, you're going to do two. You're going to go up, one, two. And again, rest. And you're going to continue that way. Try and get all the way up to ten. It's a good goal usually for pull-ups at least. Get up to ten, and then you're going to work your way back down. You get ten, then you do nine, eight, seven. You're going to really gas yourself out. You're you're going to get real tired. Your muscles are going to get all pumped. You know, it's going to be difficult. But by focusing on just that one exercise, you're basically using all of your energy for that rather than splitting it between all the exercises like on a regular circuit. Now, good numbers to shoot for um, on your pull-ups, like I said, 10, you know, work your way up to 10 then back down. Uh, for your push-ups, you could do probably hmm, 20 or 25 is a good starting number and you can increase that as you get stronger. Uh, for your sit-ups, I would say 50 and uh, or, you know, that's, that's, that's a little high for a beginner. You could probably go up with like 25 or 20, like with your uh, push-ups. And then for your squats, probably 15. I would say 15 or 20 maybe. Uh, and that's also dependent on what you've done recently for your cardio days. Like your sprint days are going to be a lot harder than on your regular running days. So that's one option. The other option is to just go to exhaustion. All right, and again, this would be on a single exercise. You would focus on just the one. So if you're doing just pull-ups, basically you're gonna do as many pull-ups as you can in one set. You're just gonna crank them out until you're done, and then you stop. Take a rest for like a full minute, minute and a half, and then do the same thing again. And do that for like three to five sets, doing as many as you can every set, and then just stop, that's it. That's your only exercise for the day. Um, finally, another great way to break plateaus is just to get extra rest. Sometimes your body needs a couple extra days off to really heal up. Uh, during those days, you obviously want to keep eating well, eat your protein, you know, get your veggies, get, you know, good fiber, good protein. You want to keep building those muscles, make sure you're getting your iron in. And uh, generally, just rest, take it easy, get some good sleep for a couple of days, and then come back to it. Sometimes, I mean, I've had days where, you know, I feel like I can't do anything. I'm totally burned out. So I take a couple of days off, you know, three, four days, maybe even a week sometimes, and I come back, and all of a sudden, I can do, you know, an extra set of pull-ups that I was not able to do before, or I can, I, I up my max number of push-up count by like five or seven or something like that, and it's like, where did that come from? I haven't been working out. It's because you rested. When you rest, your body gets to fully recover, and sometimes when you're running a really vigorous workout program, your body doesn't get to recover fully. So, just a couple exercises. You can grease the groove with a ladder setup. You can do two max repetitions and exhaustion, uh, or you can just rest. Take off a couple of days. You've been training really heavily lately. Take off relax, recuperate, and then come back to it again. All right, so I hope you enjoyed the Solid Snake workout, and until next time, remember to live boldly, change the world, and continue to be awesome.